Hello and welcome back to UKSG Red 2024. This event we are raising money for Crisis. You can donate with the links below the stream. We would also like to shout out ESA and BSG for their continued support. Now it's time for Mises, uh, Mies, who is running Silent Hill. Uh, good luck and take it away. Thank you so much, host. Yes. Hey, everyone. My name is Mr. LWD. Next to me is Mike. On the co-commentator chair for uh, for this uh, this evening. Uh, before we get started, uh, what we're we gonna do? We're gonna do the bad plus ending or the UFO ending. We are going for the. Oh, I'll just quickly refresh this in case. No, okay. We are going for the bad plus ending. Bad plus ending. So the old school uh, ending. Okay. Harry's <laughs> having a bad night. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it is it is a long day because my journey starts at like uh, seven today. So uh, yeah. With no further ado, tech ready? Yeah? Mike ready? Mike. I'm ready, just <laughs> shout when you're ready. All right, three, two, one, go. All right, this is the story about Harry Mason with his daughter, Cheryl. And what did happen, Mike? Can you elaborate for us just a tiny bit? Not very well, okay. because I remember other Silent Hills better, but if I recall correctly, there was a car accident, yeah. and Harry's woken up, and his daughter is missing, and he's not entirely sure where he is, and then he finds out he's in Silent Hill. Yeah, oh, that's, uh, that's <laughs> quite about right. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Mike. Uh, so, um, yeah, he, he did walk up, and uh, he is following his, uh, his, his daughter, and just uh, around this particular quarter is saving a few seconds on the cutscene uh, with the camera angle so that's the the first uh, time save that we uh, have uh, in uh, our pockets calling it um, so we are chasing down Cheryl uh, I think uh, down the this alley what's this door and beware of the dog uh, dogs dead um, in this uh, this this very uh, yeah it's uh, a little bit scary here. It's getting, it's getting dark. And you get uh, them crazy camera angles that yeah. Silent Hill was known for. It's, it's what with the uh, with the tank controls. It's 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 rather tricky to uh, to do so. But no uh, no offense. Harry is kicking ass uh, as usual. And now is our first objective is uh, to die. So what we're going to do is we're going to do uh, perform a quick. Turn and then what's going on? Yeah, here? we're gonna get grabbed by uh, by some uh, uh, some very nasty looking creatures here. Okay, please grab me. Th thank you. If we do the uh, UFO ending, we skip this uh, oh. sequence. Oh. So we're good. Oh no, Harry's dead. Yeah, a little, a little bit. And we woke up in a. Oh no, wait, he's all right. Room. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so we. We get a gun from from Sybil, and Sybil is the local uh, police woman of uh, yeah, Silent Hill. Um, we're gonna grab this item, a map. Uh, it's a it's a knife, some potions for just in case, uh, marathon purposes. And uh, we trigger our first cutscene. It's unskippable, and huh. we're going to uh, get going the flying radio? thing, the air screamer. And we're gonna we're gonna get him killed in order to. Uh, yeah, move along. And just as a note as well, you can't even pick the radio up until the cutscene's triggered yeah. again. So three, four, four is very decent. Uh, normally it's five, three. five shots. What's to We're gonna this take this uh, scatter. It's yeah, it's a radio. It it tells us when uh, the monsters are nearby. We're gonna take it. We're gonna move out. Um, yeah. This is going to be the run towards the school eventually. We're going to enter the school. But first things first, we need to find a set of keys. And that's a total of three keys in order to uh, get past a certain house. You must bear in mind that Silent Hill, everywhere you go, it's blocked. Every angle you go, it's blocked. You only can go in a certain direction. And uh, that's the direction where Harry is going. You also see that I'm performing a quick turn. Quick turn is faster than yeah, moving around uh, while you go, so.
So first things first, we have uh, found our first key at the baseball court. Now we have going to get our second key and that's in a trunk. Uh, third key is uh, hitting in a mailbox and the final key is um, in a doghouse. But before we go, we go there, we're gonna evade this air screamer. It's going to chase us, we're going to stray from left to right in order to get rid of him and we're good. When you do uh, the UFO f ending for example, uh, that must be played on normal level. We are now playing on easy difficulty so we have less monsters, uh, the monsters do less damage um, and as far as you go in the game the more damage you will receive. So Second key over here. With a with a nice bump. Yeah, he just did pat <laughs> patted you on the head a little, didn't he? Yeah, so fun. <laughs> move along. Move along, <laughs> sir. Move along. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Come on. <laughs> yeah, and this is this is uh, quite a uh, uh, like minute, 30, 45 seconds of straight walking. To the ends of the, uh, to the end of the road. Oh, there's another one. Hello. And we're gonna pick up a note. And on the note says, uh, "Look at the doghouse." If Harry doesn't pick up the note, Harry doesn't look in the doghouse. It just uh, uh, Harry would just say, "Oh, it's a doghouse." So we need to get that piece of paper in order to look into the doghouse. There we go. Move here. Then we have a doghouse here with some dogs, of course. Nothing to be missed. And there's a key hiding. And we're gonna enter a house. And house we're all going to get towards the school. So that's one. Two, three, three keys. Gonna get night, nightfall, and um, get dark for a little bit. Also, the air screamers and dogs are sensitive of light, so we're gonna turn off the light. You see me do that during the run. Going to put down the light on and off in order to. Don't attract those those creatures. Because it was, of course, one of the, the horror mechanics of this. The fact that you, had, you needed the light to see, yeah. but it attracted enemies. So. Yeah, you, you need to uh, work with that. <laughs> Play along. Uh, because, yeah, they are attractive to the light. And, of course, nobody wants to run no. in a horror game without a light. On. No. <laughs> we need to keep it as dark <laughs> as possible. Uh, so some parts are well lit and some parts are, yeah, just uh, keep us in the dark. And as long as you don't hear the, hear the static uh, radio, then you're good. And if you hear it, yeah, there are the monsters nearby. Alright. So. The school area. We have uh, the normal school and the horror school, or the nightmare school, whatever you want to call it. First we have the normal section. And also that happens. If you do have the wrong angle, they will grab you. First things first, we're going to get uh, some items. Uh, Silent Hill is all about key items, uh, items that you need, and hitboxes. The hitboxes of Silent Hill are very small, so y you need to line up perfectly in order to get uh, get items going. So we used an asset in order to get the golden medallion. The golden medallion we need to uh, put into a tower uh, in order to get the other section of the game. So, pass this guy. Normally this standing still in a normal mode, but we're gonna play an easy, so only only one. 
Now we have opened another room with a piano. I don't know, do you have music skills, Dave? Or Mike? Yeah, yeah. I do. Yeah, I do, yeah, I do yeah, play yeah. the piano, yeah. You play the piano? I do. Oh, cool. Badly, but I play it. <laughs> <laughs> you, you play it. Well, that's, uh, that's, that's nice to hear. Uh, we also going to play the piano. But we're going to play it uh, badly. I'd say, I'd say it's the Moonlight Sonata, but that's the wrong horror oh. game. <laughs> <laughs> also nice, though. Uh, we're going to play some bad tunes. So we only want to hear bad tunes uh, in order to uh, get the second uh, medallion. So that were the bad tunes. And then we now have the Silver Moon. Silver medallion. We're going to get out. Almost hit, but we're good. Oh. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna take some sh few seconds here. We're gonna put on the light. Wait, wait a bit so those two get disoriented, and then we have uh, plenty of time to uh, go easy. Put on the light around them, and then we head to the basement, and we're going to hit the generator. And with the generator, we are going to activate the, the clock tower. No, it's not clock tower. It's a different game. But well, I was going to say as well, anyone who's played uh, <laughs> Dead by Daylight might, if they haven't played this or any of the Silent Hills, they might somewhat recognize where you are at the moment. Yeah, I think so, yeah. So we're going to head back. The light, wait a s few seconds, and then we're good. Now we're going to hit uh, the tower here. There we go. All right. And now everything has changed. Everything is going to a nightmare. Uh, things have scattered. Yeah, it's it's a whole mess. And we are back in the school. And first things first, I'm gonna get a, a yellow key card. Yellow key card, there we go. Continue. Loads of doors, ways, areas we need to uh, need to go, and also with a lot, a lot of uh, monsters getting around. You can't do that without the light, but I did it with the light. Normally I put my lights down, but anyway, I'm gonna enter this door and pick up the only gun that we are using, and that's the shotgun. This is the only gun we're going to use in the entire game we're gonna pick up two sets of ammo and that's the run what we're going to use oh a little bit too fast now make a turn we need to have that door sometimes you want to move a little bit faster than usual Wait for the telephones, skip the cutscene, then make a turn, go here, get the rubber ball, because we need to have the rubber ball for a ditch in order to block that. Gonna go up here. Took me three to six months to learn this game. <laughs> it's the, the amount of items you have to collect in the particular order and what you do, it's... It's why I love watching games like this, but I would really struggle to speed, yeah, speed run. Yeah, I had that at the first time. It's like, oh, I, I love this game so much. I want to do a, a classic horror game. Uh, when I started speedrunning back in 2017, so I was like, oh, which are the gems? <laughs> uh, this was one of them, a Medical Solid also. And I was like, what the hell the <laughs> I started into, you know? Oh man, you're speed running, reading a like written tutorial at the same yeah. time. Yeah, I, I I saw some uh, some runners, uh, Punchy, Aaron. Uh, they were like uh, the Silent Hill uh, legends, if you may yeah, say punchy, so. Punchy for sure. Punchy. Yeah. Met him at at um, Berlin though at um, uh, what do you TwitchCon. Had a had a little bit of conversation. So a pretty cool guy, and um, also with. The controls with the routing, etc. It 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 is it has been optimized uh, during the the years, but I was like, okay, I'm gonna 
start and finish on something and I don't want to change my route <laughs> in any way. <laughs> you know, I was like, that's the thing that we're going to do. And yeah, that's it pretty much. So, um, get the ball. Don't forget the uh, shotgun though. I'm uh, gonna gonna switch to that and uh, turn this valve. So this is also a cutscene we cannot skip. We, we can skip the rest, but this is the unskippable cutscene. Um, and we need a key. So I was looking. Oh, there's a key. But the first thing you need to do is uh, look for it and see. Oh, there's no key. And then we can put in the ball and turn down the valve. So. Now we're going to get all the way down to get the key from uh, the training, the yeah, the ditch, the ditch, and uh, gonna get our final section going from uh, from the school. This. Silent Hill is also well known from his uh, maze and uh, maze parts, etc. Uh, we also uh, have to put in a section later on if you like uh, go the different direction in that section, you're going to go for infinite looping. So yeah, you, don't you don't want that. <laughs> Speaking of things you don't want, I notice that you're not running the HD collection version of this. Is there uh, any yeah. reason why? <laughs> but, uh, the HD collection started uh, only at the uh, second part of Silent Hill, so uh, second <laughs> <laughs> Silent Hill 2 and 3. Uh, Silent Hill 3 is doable, <laughs> but Silent Hill 2 uh, not w uh, whatsoever. So yes, you, know, you don't you want to want to play that. Silent Hill one dodged a bullet with that collection, yeah, for sure. As you say, three is just about playable on it, but uh, yeah, if you're going to play any of these games, just yeah, avoid that. It's fine. There is a, uh, a remastered version coming out on the PS5. We don't know when, but it's in the make. It's on its way. It's on its way. <laughs> the release, we don't know. But um, we'll see. Well, it's the it's Silent Hill 2 remake first, isn't it, bizarrely? Yeah, yeah. Be because the, uh, the story about that game uh, is yeah the, the player's favorite. Yeah. So, split head. Um, we're gonna we're gonna kill him. Um, first three shots. Open his mouth. If he hits you, it, you're dead instantly. So, and that's the school. Very nice. You have also uh, a, a knife. Knife category. I've seen the knife category. <laughs> oh, you have seen it? <laughs> it oh is man. brutal with split head. It is insane. You have such a tight margin yeah. of hitting him and not getting hit. <laughs> it's uh, it's quite difficult because you need to like hack and slash all the way around and then around him and yeah, it's in it's insane. And now it's back to normal. Um, some people also know they they say. If you're going to go outside, oh, it's snowing. No, it's ashes because the town has set up a fire and um, yeah, it's raining ashes because the town is still cooling down. You also see that in the movie, quite nice how they did the movie. So you have Shara and Alyssa, and Alyssa is the uh, the evil twin uh, of the of the pair. And she is calling. She is calling Cheryl because she wants to unite once again with his uh, with his sister in order to get uh, everyone die again in Silent Hill because it's all about dying and evilness and yeah. Yeah, they go into the plot more in later games, but the short version is there's like an evil cult that lives in uh, yeah, and that that was cult <laughs> living in Silent Hill. And um, yeah, that they, the twins basically one was turned evil, one turned good, but yeah, get down with Harry, and uh, yeah, the other one was uh, staying here, eventually. So we are now away to the church, gonna do some prayers, uh, gonna get some items, and uh, then we are on our way to the hospital, and yeah, that happens again. 
Also, when I'm going, uh, if I die, we don't want that, but if I die, I need to, like, do uh, the whole section over again. Um, you have save points, but it takes time to save, etc., etc. We don't want that. So, we're going to pay attention to our health along the way. And, uh, yeah, it's easy, so should be okay. All right, so I always get a little nervous when the ambient noise cuts out when you go through the door. <laughs> I think it's crashed for a second. Well, the first time that I played this game, um, I think it was in what the game was released in '99. Oh yeah, something like that. Uh, yeah, 2000. So I was, I think I played it a year later. That was early 2000. Then when I was 13, early early teens, you know, and uh, I scared the living shit out of me <laughs> <laughs> when I entered the school and the, those those goats will pop off the <laughs> the walls you know it's like <laughs> I, I couldn't play this as a kid uh, I no. just found it too it was too scary it was too scary and I know for, for anyone watching this now with this pixelated mess thinking how could this <laughs> possibly be scary trust me back in the day this was scared this was a scary game and uh, Silent Hill 2 even more they just took everything that made yeah. this one great and and cranked it up another notch for sure. Just to um, let you guys know, it might make you feel slightly old. Uh, this game is older than me. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, just to just to let you know. Thank you, thank you, host. You're very welcome. You've <laughs> aged better, Tom. Bo. <laughs> <laughs> the OG uh, running here. So <laughs> yeah, if you have anything to say, any donations or something like that, go ahead because yeah. we're on the way to the hospital. Of course, um, uh, we of course would like to thank ESA for supporting this marathon. Uh, besides providing us with the, the channel for streaming, they, uh, they are sharing gear and technical assistance. ESA Winter 2024 is right around the corner on the 17th to the 24th of February, so tune in on this channel on those days to check it out. Thank you so much. So we're going to try to keep the estimate alive. Uh, we're going to end the game uh, hopefully around 55 minutes. Uh, no more, no less, <laughs> because uh, yeah, we, we were on and off with, uh, with our estimate, so... We have time, we have time. And so far so good with the, with the run though. We are now at the hospital. And this is a guy, hello, bye. Had a little bit of, a little less conversation with him. And we're going to get our uh, key again. Tank controls. Sometimes it, uh, it's going the wrong direction because you need to uh, go with your direction the opposite way. Um, sometimes you're like, oh yeah, we need to go the other way, because you uh, immediately want to exit the right direction in order to save time. Here we're going to get a bottle, I'm going to get a quick turn here, and we're going to collect some goo, I call it goo, um, in order to skip a certain area. Later on, uh, we're going to tell more about that. Yeah, that this game gets a lot of criticism these days for its tank controls, but they're not actually as bad as they're made out to be once you get used to them. Yeah, that's exactly <laughs> that's exact exactly right, Mike. If you like do the run over and over again, you get used to it. But um, I do know that people are like <laughs> cursing <laughs> the controls. Well, I know, I know it's a big bone of contention with the Silent Hill 2, re 2 remake if they're yeah. going to re reuse tank controls or not. I, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Uh, so we're going to go uh, all the floors, two, three, and then magically appears a fourth floor. Because anything can happen in Silent Hill. All right, fourth floor. Everything has changed once again. We are in the other world. Nightmare section, whatever you want to call it. Evil sisters, bad doctors, everything is uh, set up here. And uh, yeah, it's once again collect collecting things. Starting with this plate of a turtle, we need to collect four of them. Yeah, we got a glimpse of a nurse just there, didn't we? Yeah, 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 yeah. They, they could be nice, but they can also provide bad, aren't you? Yeah, if they get in your way. 
Yeah. Like, oh, we're good. No, that was good. That was good. That was good RNG. They could turn uh, or like uh, standing in the wrong direction and they grab you and that's yeah, that's not, not that good. Going with the elevator here. First floor. We have a vending machine. And in the vending machine we have two health potions. And that should be <laughs> in enough. In the vending machine that <laughs> looks like that. This health. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, Harry is kind of thirsty. There was a doctor. Uh, he does, uh, yeah, he does damage. We don't want to get grabbed by him. Just leave it like this. All right, nurse. We're gonna get the lighter here. The lighter we need to, in order to get the uh, fire going. Here we have a, a creature a tentacle. More like an octopus, rather creepy. Gonna throw the blood bag that we picked up early, and then we have the display. Now we have four, and these four we're going to need for this door. And I always mess it up <laughs> uh, because uh, lately uh, I don't know uh, which one is going where, so. Gonna try it for a bit, see if it have it one in one try. Otherwise the yellow and the blue are in the opposite direction. Yeah, opposite direction. Okay, so we move the yellow plate. And then we're going to get uh blue plate. That's the opposite direction. What is yellow? What was it? Right above, right? Uh, blue top right, yeah. Top right, and yeah. And yellow top left. Bottom left. Bottom, bottom left. Bottom left. <laughs> and if and it's not, we're doing it for a third time. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all because we need to go around that spec, right? <laughs> and it is where the nurses can be a little awkward. Yeah. She was doing nothing other than just being in the way there. <laughs> Right, so, pick up a key, go around her, gonna take this, we're gonna take this uh, alcohol, and we're good. So far so good. We didn't get grabbed, now we get to the basement, um, because this is not your particularly hospital, this is a psych psychiatric hospital. Uh, so no, it couldn't be a nice one, could yeah. it? <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to get locked up here. <laughs> and uh, this is this is the secret area where Harry is going into. Uh, because, yeah. We're getting drawn to Alyssa. And Alyssa was locked up, made for experiments. Uh, and there we could we find a final key in order to get out of the hospital. And on our way to uh, to the mall, to the Silent Hill Mall. And if I'm right in thinking, if we were doing the UFO ending, which we're not, yeah, you'd be getting pretty close to the end by this point, wouldn't you? Uh, no, we still have a uh, t t 20 What's minutes, this? 20 20 minutes to go, give or take. Oh, okay. Um, but we don't have to like pick up the goo and the bottle because that section never happened. Um, and we did use the channeling stone on the roof uh, of the of the school. And every time you use the channeling stone, Harry is going to look at aliens. What? What's this? Because What's this? that's the only bit I'm a bit fuzzy on. I've, I've, I said I absolutely love horror speed runs, but sometimes remembering all the different steps for the different yeah, it categories. Is. It can it can be quite uh, quite stressful. <laughs> Like, oh, did that, that happen this before? It's like w w with the stones, you know. So I was like, okay, there's a top left, bottom left, <laughs> bottom right. W what was it again, you know? Uh, played this game too long, I guess. And yeah, that's the hospital section. Was I dreaming? Was I dreaming? No. Huh. Eh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Don't forget this key, though. <laughs> this is a key. The antique shop key. If you like miss it, 
forget it, you need to backtrack. And I, I had to get it like one or two times. Uh, I was so focused, I was on PB pace, and I forget the key, and I was like, yeah, GG. <laughs> <laughs> that happens often. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but backtracking w in the fog is rather difficult. Because um, you need to, like, think the opposite way you need to go. Yeah. You don't want that. So, we are on our way to an antique shop, and in the antique shop is going, yeah, it, it changed the surroundings again. We are in the other world again, and... Um, Normally we're going to do a romper skip there, but for marathon safety purposes we don't want to do that because if I soft lock or go into the void, then we need to like do the whole section over it's again. It's a lot of backtracking. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So you don't want that. And uh, with the PSTV is also quite difficult because you need to glitch through a door and you need to go around the door in order to get uh, straight ahead in the void and. Um, yeah, it's well known as the most difficult uh, part uh, if you run on PSTV as we do uh, currently. So yeah. Instead of um, doing the romper, we getting the worm. Uh, we're going to fight the worm with our shotgun, opening one or two times. Um, we'll see. Skipping the cutscene. Um there we go. Oh. We're gonna we, we will uh, turn off our light here because uh if the romper jumps you uh you're gonna you're gonna get damaged. If it if it bites you it will be twice as hard. We're going to go left here when we want to hear the dog. It's here, there's the dog. An opening here. And now we are on the Silent Hill Mall. His daughter in a glitch. <coughs> we're gonna go upstairs here. Uh, you can pick up a, a hunting rifle here, but we know we don't need it. We have enough ammo for our uh, shotgun. We're gonna take a few steps back. Uh, almost one try. Very hard to get it first try. It is. Ah! I had the hit. If I didn't have the hit, then uh, I was good. There we go. That was the worm. Bye, worm. Now we're gonna wait for uh, the worm to collapse. Get, get back and... Um, gonna get continue with our journey. Still, nightmare section. Other world. Uh, everything is dark. Uh, everything has changed. Um, so we need to get our way back into the hospital. We're going to, to uh, do uh, a scene. We trigger a scene in in the hospital. Uh, we're going to trigger a scene in the hospital in order to get the float stinger going, and that's a uh, yeah. I think it's a uh, it's an evolved thing about the worm because it's flying it's a moth so so you want your light off for if it's a moth then <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Some, there is something luckily we don't have to do the whole hospital over again but we do need to trigger a cutscene here normally I use also the second time with my uh, Channeling stone. That's uh, in, in this section. So more aliens will gather around every time you use uh, use the, the more aliens will gather around you. But we don't have to do that. So we have the bad plus ending. The bad plus ending is uh, one of the good of the the, the fastest uh, categories you need to have. In order to uh, beat the game. So this is the moth. Uh, float stinger. And we're going to shoot it. Like uh, between 12 and 15 times. Uh, we're going to keep on going with circles. We don't want to get hit. 
Um, and we want to stay close near the exit. Uh, because if we uh, if we are done with our shooting, then we can uh, have a fast exit. There we go. There we go. Perfectly. Very nice. That was very perfectly. The only thing that I need to do is like turn around and uh, go down. So, so that's uh, pretty cool. And now we are on our way to the sewers. And the sewers is a section, like I said, you don't want to get lost. It's, you need to go a specific direction. If you don't go the right direction, then you, yeah, keep on turning into circles. You don't want that. No. Want to go straight forward. Get into the right direction. We have uh, time for a quick donation. Yeah, go for yeah. it. Uh, we have a ten dollar donation from Solid Drake, who says, "Love Silent Hill One. The atmosphere is still incredible." Uh, I am very glad you killed that moth. Moths are very <laughs> <scary>. <laughs> moths, are, moths are terrifying. I just. Ugh. Uh, thanks for uh, for the donation, Tony. Appreciate it, man. All for the good cause. All right, now. All right, we're going to. Ah, uh, we're good. We're still in the green. I always check it because when they grab you, the scratches, they do damage. They do an um, efficient amount of damage. Three, four times, uh, you receive damage. You're, you're, you're done. And with the normal, oh, that's good RNG, by the way. Um, we we want to avoid getting grabbed or getting scratched like that. Um, I'm gonna check it for a bit. Ah, uh, works. So and go here. Also, um, doors. You don't want to bunk the door. Um, you want to like slide on the difficult, yeah, on the, the, just the direct angle. Yeah, kind of graze them. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, in order to go through, um, get a, get a key here. You have one particular door in Silent Hill where you already passed that door, but you just yeah let go of the analog stick and then you can uh, go safely uh, through the door. We're gonna make a U-turn. I hear I hear the scratcher here. So thank you, appreciate it. Um, uh, just one potion. And then hopefully we don't get scratched again. Hello. Yeah, thank you. Oh, very good. Appreciate it. Because sometimes they're in the wrong angle. <coughs> you need to pass them. Uh, but sometimes, yeah, it can be not can be avoided to to receive some damage. Right, we're going to enter here. Almost uh, near the uh, the end of the sewers. End of sewers. Uh, we're gonna grab a key to exit the sewers on, on the yeah the right set of stairs, set of ladders, in order to exit the sewers. Yeah, going right here. I was like, when I go left, it's right, and when I go right, it's the left. <laughs> with the uh, with the doors, I was uh, mix them up. I was just noticing there's a few little cockroaches over the floor. Can they actually yeah. hit you? Yeah, or? they can hit you. They can grab you, and nibble nibble you a bit. Right, you yep. know, um, they do not much damage, but yeah, it affects your health. Um, and if you have more than enough, then. Uh, Eventually, you you can die from them. Uh, you don't want that. Uh, so the key is keep on running. <laughs> don't get grabbed. <laughs> uh, if you put out the light, then they 
just wandering in the dark, so that's a thing that uh, helps. But uh, yeah, we're not like standing on one place. So I'm gonna make you turn here, and that's the sewers. Pretty good, pretty decent. We didn't get uh, much damage there. A little some. A little, but not a, a lot. Um, so with the UFO ending, we're going to go straight ahead to towards the hotel. We're going to use the channeling stone there, but we don't need it. We don't need it. We are on our way towards. The boathouse. We have a romper here. Oh, oh. Crossing the bridge. And then the other world is back once again. Need to line up for a bit here because there are two rompers here close by. So this section is going to be a little bit in the dark. There it was, there was one. I have some points of recognition that I have. Vescarage, that's the left. So I know that I'm closing in into the there we go. To the boat. And also with the boat, you need to use the channeling stone, but that's the fourth one. The fifth one is in the lighthouse, and then it's GG. Uh, so we are on our way to the lighthouse, uh, but we're going to pick it up from there because, yeah, we're not doing new UFO ending. It's a bad plus ending. Sybil. Not just bad, it's bad plus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <coughs> So you have bad plus, good uh, good ending. Uh, I'm gonna turn off the light here. Because there's also a romper here. Don't want that. Cross this. To the left. There we go. Stairs here. Turn around. Oh, turn around. Oh, Harry. Oh, calm down, Bonnie Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. This way. If you keep your light off, then the air screamers will not get you directly. They still hear you, but their uh, orientation is a little bit off. So. Oh, oh, there we go. It made you just kind of snagged on the edge of the railing there, <laughs> didn't you? <laughs> Because I had one on my heels. <laughs> Want to loosen that up. So, what a thrill with darkness and silence through the night. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, wrong game. Yeah. How to get solo? Oh, there we go. Did you know that recently that uh, they found a skip to skip the ladder? Have they? Yeah. It's only a few years old. Um, so that was used to be one of the more frustrating parts of yeah, that speed. Yeah, because it to takes spend two, three <laughs> minutes. <laughs> two, three minutes to climb so, it. So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that was the, 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 the key of the, of the host. And uh, that, that was, like, on on the on the game. Uh, but now you have a certain angle or a certain direction that you need to use. Uh, and you shoot like uh, an arrow. All the way up. Oh and you wow. skip it, yeah. Very very insane. Alright, so we have our second phase or second part of sewers. We're going to do. It's rather easy, straightforward and not that not as hard as as the first section, so there we go.
gonna take it right here. And another right here. And now we're going to do the carnival skip. You, you remember the bottle, right? That I picked up? Yep. Uh, so bottle of goo was that? Yeah, the bottle of goo. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to use that um, in order to skip the, the carnival. And we use that on white ghosts. The, the, the same tiny ghosts that are like going out to the wall in the uh, school section. So. And that's it. That's the the skip. The only skip in the game. It saves oh, quite a few, few times. It's a... Uh, and it's nowhere. And nowhere is... Yeah. Uh, nowhere. It's... A collection of all the levels that we had. So we had school, we had hospital, everything. And it's all messed up. So when you go down into the basement, go to this door, you're in a classroom. <laughs> you know, it's like, what? <laughs> classroom? And you go to this door and... Huh? So that's that's the that's nowhere. Well, it, it's always somewhat vague about what the nightmare world in Silent Hill is, isn't it? Because in, there's some indications that it's more of a mental kind of construction, and yeah. there's some that it actually does exist, and that Silent Hill is just a place, you know, where everyone goes, but not everyone wants to leave immediately. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you you don't want to you don't want to do that, you know. <laughs> so we're gonna take the players here. Screw that uh, key, key because yeah, keys. Welcome to Silent Hill, Um Going around this door, this door, and we have a first puzzle. Kind of puzzle. Arms and toes. So it's six arms and legs. Uh, four and eight. Go. Then we have the time stone here in our hands. It doesn't manipulate time, but then we are going to go here. We are on alert, so that's alert. That was nicely done because on a control <laughs> on a controller. That's that is, very hard. that is quite clumsy, <laughs> so to do that that quickly is, is yeah. pretty good. Also very uh, ahead of estimate though. <laughs> <laughs> Only a few minutes. Okay, we're gonna straight for your booth for a bit. Uh, it's a door here. Uh, yeah. I needed to have a moment in order to... Okay, we have the ton of time, so we're going to go here. Going to go into, into the clock. And then the next key. I'm going to take the elevator to the third floor. Get some <coughs> items there. And we're going to fill up a door. Uh, first, we need to, to have the three keys in order to get the door open at the, at the, at the start. And now we need a whole door instead of uh, items in order to get another door open. So, bullets, points, things that you can um, put in. Also, this is the this is not RNG, this, this is the same combination over and over yeah, again. So. Yeah. And we have the birdcage gear here. Gonna get back, gonna get go to the second floor. There we go. One, two. That's all we need. Two shots. Take this item and another item. Go 
And we're gonna get here because we need to go this way in order to get these doors open. If you don't go this way, if you don't open the doors, uh, hello. Swinging a mess off the <laughs> nest. <net. laughs> um, yeah, then we're pretty much uh, pretty much screwed uh, because we then we soft locked again. We picked up a ring, and the ring we're going to use in order to get the chain closed. If we don't do that, and we pick up this sword or the dagger, uh, the door will open. Yeah, it will grab you and it's game over. It's game over, yep. yeah. We don't want that. We got that nice little ring <laughs> that's holding him in. It's there. holding <laughs> everything in between. <laughs> right. Take the ank across the room. Uh, do you like uh, jelly beans? Yeah. yeah, yeah, jelly beans are good. Oh, well. Maybe not them particular the ones. <laughs> <laughs> These are Silent Hill jelly beans. Very, very very want, special. I'm not sure if I want them flavors. <laughs> it has a key in it. What a Silent Hill without a key, right? All right. Um, we're gonna turn down the generator in order to get a door open. There we go. For our final item. Oh, I always get grabbed there. I had once or twice that I didn't get grabbed, but it's very rare because you need a, a particular angle in order to get past them. I'll be honest, I didn't even see that until it grabbed me. <laughs> <laughs> you hear it, you hear it. It's like, oh, okay. Oh. There we go. That was one. Nice. And yeah, final item here. Oh. Still the same bed. There we go. The disc of uh, Hubula Hubula. <laughs> <laughs> the disc of what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> and because we are closing in uh, t towards the end of the game, it is that time. Uh, the items that I said are like putting on the door here. So, dagger, the disc. And time is coming up soon, so a hand on the bottom mic. I'm hovering. <laughs> You're hovering. <laughs> <laughs> when we are uh, killing. There we go. Wait for the electric. One, two, three, four, five, six time. <laughs> and that's Silent Hill bad plus ending, Mike. So what's so bad for Harry out of all this? Because uh, we've skipped a lot of plot. Yeah, he's killed his daughter eventually. So oh. Then save him. Oh, and then there's no Silent Hill 3. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, around 52. That's uh, It's not a PB, but it's, uh, it's a quite decent it's, pace. It's a decent time. Um, Leave like this? Yeah. This thanks, to, uh, thanks to UKSG Cheryl. for having me. Very pleased to be here. Well, we get um, to have you once more. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> In about... Half hour, maybe. <laughs> yeah, because the next one is setting up. It's something with a with a door, but the host will get back to it uh, shortly. Uh, after that, we're going to do Resident Evil Village. And you'll be going hosting, right? I'll be hosting for that. Yeah, you're hosting that. So don't go anywhere because that's the run you definitely want to see. So yeah, back to your host. <laughs> Thank you very much. What a spooky run that was. <laughs> that was great. Uh, we have a quick donation here We ha uh, from uh, Chris G uh, G4 who says, uh, Hi, Hey, Mies, what, what do you call this game if there were no enemies, no spooky vibes, and you could just walk around in a lovely town? Silent chill. <laughs> <laughs> that was actually funny. Very that cool, very Chris. Good. Very that cool. Very uh, so that went to the kill the animals incentive for Super Metroid. Um, nice. Yes, like me said, coming up next we have Paint the Town Red, uh, run by Ragadan. Um, this is going to be me 
Uh, I will no longer be hosting, you know, hold back the tears, guys. I will be back in a few hours uh, with a God of War run. But right now, nice. we have Paint the Town Red by Ragadan. I will see you all later.